So you may be asked to draw a Venn diagram given some probabilities. Okay, so really what we want to do is we want to go straight in, get a Venn diagram ready for A and B. And what you want to do from there is with a Venn diagram, you always, always want to look to see if you've been given the intersection. Okay, because what you want to do with a Venn diagram to fill it in is to work from the inside and work outwards. Okay, so you want to start with that intersection, the 0 0.05. That's the bit that's going to go in the middle. Okay, now with that done, you can then look at the two other probabilities working your way out. So let's have a look at A first. The probability of A is 0 0.8. So that means that the whole of the circle of A must be 0 0.8. We've already got 0 0.05 as the intersection. So whatever is here must be what's left of the 0 0.8. So that must be 0 0.75 in order for those two probabilities to add up to 0 0.8. OK, that's why we've got to start in the middle. Then, for B, we know that all of that is 0 0.1. So that means that this missing probability here, these two must add up to 0 0.1, and so that must be 0 0.05. So then, once you've got that, we're not quite done, because we need to check if there's a probability on the outside. The 0 0.05, 0 0.05 add up to 0 0.1. Adding up the 0 0.75 gets me to 0 0.85. So that must mean that there's 0 0.15 outside of the circles, because all those probabilities have got to add up to 1.